What's up, YouTube? What's going down, boys? It's uh, 5.59. <clears throat> I'm uh, headed to the job now. Um, whew, head's going crazy, because all morning I could think about, like, you know, how stoked I am right now at this moment. And then you're always rushing to the next thing. Like, even if you're happy, you're always still, like, looking forward to the next big event or the next thing in your life that you're going to do or something you have planned. But the truth of the matter is, thinking about it, is like when you're stoked or you feel happy or you feel content, you should indulge in that exact moment, not look forward to the later or <clears throat> look into the past or anything like that because that moment of happiness isn't guaranteed to last forever and it's not guaranteed to ever come back. So like, I, I gotta learn and we all have to learn to really live in the moment and really just be happy when we're happy not not look forward to the next thing just try and live in the moment so I've been thinking about that this morning especially with my daughter getting so old so fast it's like one next thing you know dude she's gonna be old it's crazy because like a day ago I remember like she was so little I was pretty much just waiting until she could get older to do cool stuff now it's like BAM it's here and it's like <clears throat> it's crazy so just think about that in your uh, time, your next uh, couple hours, think about how important the moment is instead of the future. So, all right, heading to work, meeting up with the boys. Uh, hope you guys are having a good day. Uh, thanks for the support. Thanks for the love. You. What's up, Pato? You feel sick today? <laughs> Suzuki. <laughs> What's up? You don't got anything to say. <laughs> you know what I think? Total pato. I don't want nothing! Get a more and put the side. Yeah. Gotta unload this trash, boys. Come on. You want it closer? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, boy. That's too close. You want McDonald's? This is what you're claiming? Yep. Dude, I just put ketchup on this thing and condiments killed America. You never heard that? Mm. Well, it's true. <laughs> What's up, boys? Heading back to the compound right now from a heavy day at work, building that wall, finishing up that fucking driveway, and uh, just cruising right now on 202, and uh, I pretty much have hit every light, so it's been very frustrating, but um, I'm stoked. Fuck, what can I say? Hope you guys are living the dream today. Uh, just add because I'm trying to figure out, okay, this is where I'm going. All right, so getting on to Route 100. Nah, not Route 100. 202, pay only downing down, boys. Phew! For the boys! Live your dream! Fuck it! Yeah, boys, just here uh, on the compound now. Just took a shower. About to work on the truck. Got to put the tail light back in and clean the windows and stuff because <clears throat> just been letting a lot of stuff slip. The tail light's been out for a while. I'm lucky I haven't gotten pulled over, so it is time to put the tail light back in, boys. Ew! Alright, boys, so this is what I mean by fix my tail light. I've been driving around with just my brake light hanging down like that. So, <laughs> what I. <coughs> Fuck. What I gotta fix first is take all this old duct tape off here, here, clean the side of the truck up, and then, uh,. Go in here, grab the tail light that's been floating around for a couple weeks in here. Right here. Bam. Clean that tail light off. Get it ready for the new duct tape. 
put this sucker back in here and poof, ready to ride. Got some new decorative duct tape to replace the old gummy bear duct tape. For the boys, here we go. All right, my first move I think is gonna be to apply some of this goo on. I think this shit's gonna be the key to loosening it up. So I'm just gonna put it on there, let it sit. Not easy, boys. Alright, I'll check back in with you guys when I, uh, this sucks. For the boys. Alright, boys, I got as much of the stickers off as I'm gonna get off. This stuff won't come off, so I'm hoping the other duct tape just covers it up. Right now, I'm gonna clean the truck off, especially to get this goo gone and stuff off here, so I can tape it up good. So, I'm gonna hose the truck down, brush her down with my little fireman brush, and then, Hook the light up. All right, here we go. Hose her down, boys. All right, boys. Just got the truck all cleaned up. Stoking on how it looks. Cleaned up good. And right now I'm about to put the light in. So I got to put all these light bulbs in. Make sure uh, that they're in the right order so they do the right thing. And then, fuck, I need a rag to dry this off. But dude, I just wanna say this real quick. I came over here to do this five minutes ago, but I had to walk away and take a little break and let mother nature do its thing because there were birds, little baby birds that were living up there in a nest and they just learned how to fly and they were flying out with their mom and stuff. And when I walked over here, I didn't realize it at first. And the one baby fell on the porch and the mom flew away because they don't like humans, obviously. And I watched it, and was crying. So then I went over there and hung out in the garage and watched it. And the mom came over, did its thing, and they both flew out. And now they're all over there in the tree chirping together. So that was pretty cool to see. Um, really cool to see. I just watched some really gnarly Mother Nature shit. Phew. All right, boys, so I gotta put these lights in here, one by one. So, I'm thinking here that they would have shortest one on the bottom. So that would be this one. I'm not a mechanic, but I play mechanic, that's for sure. It's pretty fun to play mechanic. When you can, it's worth it. Okay, here we go. Got all the lights in. You can see them right here. They're all in where they go. And then I'm gonna put this in, try and get it centered to where I want it. And tape it in for its final resting place. Mwahaha. So, that's the deal, boys. Ew! Dude, 100K turns in and she's still going for it. How many more K turns? Two. Two to 10? Am I gonna hit this car? <laughs> you don't even have your permit yet. Oh, I actually do. It's good till... Gee, actually, why don't you drive home? Something. Yeah, why don't you drive home? You wanna drive home? Yeah, that'd be crazy. You should drive home and film it. Dude, I would... <laughs> you would die right here. Gee has her permit. She's thinking about driving home, Radical. No, don't, don't let, don't, I wouldn't, it's Route 100. At least pull over at Agway. We're not. And then let her drive Pew Town, that's a nice road. Zero chance of Pew Town. Pew Town, yeah. You don't need it, that's bullshit, like, no, your name's in the system. Your whole life's in the system. Yeah, dude, it actually is. I know, if you really think about it, it is. my state ID, it was weird. All in the system. They had an old picture of her. Pull over at Agway, let her drive, it's good for her character. All right, boys, my battery's dying right now, but I officially got this light on. 
and I'm stoked about that. Amping for the boys. You gonna go in and change this battery? You.